guess it's a midweek date night, right? What day is it? Wonderful Wednesday. It is. It used to be Waverly Wednesday. Memphis said, he was watching one of our vlogs and he said, well, if Fancy Friday is your special day, what's my special day? Memphis Monday. Memphis Monday. So we are just having an impromptu date. Shug had a basketball game too. Yeah, we've been at a basket. We've been at Shug's game. He did awesome. But he's having a cousin sleepover. He's having a continued cousin sleepover. <laughs> he's just keeps staying at my mom's with his two cousins. But they're going home tomorrow, so. Oh, it's lightning, y'all. There have been horrible storms here. So we're walking down to Sugar Bacon. We're ready for a date, aren't we? So y'all, this is pretty funny. We get to this restaurant and we can eat them. They're, they're closed. They're closed. They're closing. So this is a very impromptu date night. So we're running because look, can you see the lightning? It's raining, people. It's raining. Everywhere. My wife <laughs> picked, picked the spot where it's you have to boring. walk everywhere to find a restaurant. Yeah, it is God. pouring. Pouring. Uh, you can't really see the I rain. Told her, I told her it was going to rain. Oh, look, can you see behind us? It's weird. You don't really see the rain in this video. Well, you, it's kind of hard to see rain in the video. Is it hard to see rain in the video? I guess yeah. so. I so, y'all, we're running to Square Burger. We like it. Let me see if y'all can see. This is our current situation. Can y'all see? This is called a pour down. I do not have an umbrella. Okay, let's think of our best plan of attack. Should we go down and across? Our best plan of attack is... To go across? No, is to wait till it stops raining some. Okay, well, it's lightning. Okay, y'all. We'll let you know we're about to be soaked. What's the rental? There's three doors. One, the scorpions. And I no, 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 no. Was it the, the, the open the doors and it was a ghost in it. There's okay. one with scorpions. One full with bees and wasps, a red wasps, and and then there's one who what sharks have been eaten in seas six weeks. Which one do you pick? Uh, so there's one with scorpions. Mm -hmm. Does it sting you? Yeah, that one. And then or the, bees, and, bees, and, bees, and the spider bees, was no, bees. and then bee, bees and bees and um beans and red wasps. Bees and then hungry sharks from night from oh shark have been eaten since in six weeks. Which one sharks that haven't eaten in six weeks. Cause they're already dead. How did you know? They that? starved to death because they hadn't eaten in six weeks. How do you know that?
and pretty excited to be here. I am in the presidential suite down here, which is pretty cool. I guess they call it the Sharp Adam Suite. There's a new hotel. This is my stuff in um, College Station that overlooks their football field. So I am just getting checked in. Let's take a look at the bedroom first if I want to. Oh my gosh. Garrett. And Aggie Land. Here's the TV, fireplace. I only sad part about this. Let's see. It's, okay, that's better. Because I'm here working by myself. <laughs> Shay needs to drive down here, or maybe Waverly or Garrett, y'all want to come spend the night with me? Surely there's another bed. So here I am. I've been working all day, y'all. So here's the bathroom. Beautiful. Turn some lights on. Oh, I love that. I wonder why that room needs to be that big for the toilet. Does anyone know? Here it is. A beautiful bathtub and the shower. I am at the brand new, I think it's new, I could be wrong, Texas A&M Hotel overlooking Kyle Field. And I think that's a door that goes, there's a balcony that goes all the way around. Let me see. Can I get lights? I need lights. So here's the living room. There's another television. Fireplace. Y'all. Can y'all say luxury? I don't know a lot about A&M, so I don't know who this man is. Kissing this dog. But I'm digging this hotel room. I'll tell y'all that much. I guess in case I need to look at the stars. Table. Now look out this window, which then there's a the balcony too. Here's Kyle Field. Right there. There's another living room. I just love hotels. Like, I love them. <laughs> they make me happy. <laughs> so, I just had to show everybody. I was pretty impressed with this one. Here's my kitchen. My Keurig's ready. I can make my coffee in the morning. Let's go out here. Let's look. There's the pole. I'll sing it. Rocking chairs overlooking Kyle Field. I'm sure this room is booked up for during football season. But I'm lucky to stay here tonight while I'm down here working. So I'm pretty excited. And then there's that patio like this on the other side. Texas A&M. Howdy. Gig em. Whatever they say. I don't know a lot about this dog, but Garrett was telling me about it because I don't know that much about a and Look at this. Oh, look at my bed. I don't want to go to sleep tonight. I'm not real sure how to turn on the um, fireplace, but I will be pulling those curtains. So, keep going. This is me. This is my bathroom. Look at this tub. I wanted a tub. I got one. <laughs> so I just had to share. I was like, this is just, I love, I love Godweeks. I love them. 
Hey, C6 fam, get ready to get in the bath. I just have to say, I've been working and it's so nice when you just get little surprises like a super incredible room when you're out of town and away from your family because most people don't know I hate being gone from my babies. I'm, you can tell I'm pretty tired tonight. It's been a long day. I had a lot of driving and but the good thing is that I personally know whether I was in a hotel like this or not, but the work is always, 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 always worth it. So I never doubt the grind. I never dread the grind. But tonight, this was definitely a little God wink for sure, as we are working to do some great big things. So good night, y'all. I'm about to go get my bath. I don't know. I still don't have my bath. I'm in awe of where I'm staying. So I'm very, uh, I don't know if I can sleep. <laughs> I was still in shame. I said, I don't know if I can go to sleep tonight. He said, well, you better. You got a lot of work to do tomorrow. So I am going to go to sleep, but I'm enjoying every single second of being in this incredible, incredible room. Yes, I am. And I do travel everywhere. If you've watched me go around the world, one of my best friends, Missy O'Neill, bought me this blanket for my birthday. And I sleep with it every night. I think of her and I love it. So. I get in the bath and I see this remote. Okay, this says, let's see. Y'all know, I'm just like a country girl. Okay, wait, it says electric mirror. What does this mean? Y'all want to see? Okay, hold on. I don't want to really be in it because I'm about to get in the tub. <gasps> what does this mean? I'm not real. I mean, I know my nickname's Fancy. Oh, it's just a TV inside there. Look. It says, Welcome to Texas A&M. Kimberly Copeland. Yes. Channel right. She works everything, y'all, at home. I don't do anything ever. He does it all for me. So I'll keep y'all posted if I can get the TV on while I take a bath. Look at that bathtub. So excited. So that's what I'm about to do. I know I'm probably like ultra redneck, but I've never seen this in my life. Watch this. Show y'all this one more time because I've never seen this in my life. So it cleans it, and when I sat down on this toilet, I don't know if I'm just <gasps> look at this. The seat is heated, heated seat. <laughs> I am in awe. <laughs> I, maybe this is something the rest of the world knows about, but I don't. So today has kind of been one of those super busy, just back to back to back. I've had coaching appointments, just I'm working, 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 and I'm on the road. So I'm headed to another lady that I'm helping reach some really big goals. And and I saw Pizza Hut. I get, I love pizza, y'all, love it. So over the weekend, late at night, we would get Papa John's, and I like every kind of pizza. Like if it's pizza, I like it, but I love Pizza Hut. So I like a thin crust pepperoni extra sauce. Now a lot of Pizza Huts have trouble with this, so let's see, because I just got my pizza I'm gonna eat on the road while I'm driving. <gasps> Oh, they did amazing. I can already see. I can see the sauce. So, I'm about to be driving and munching on my pizza. And I'm very pumped. So, that's just another little side thing about me, if you don't know. I love pizza. Okay, so let me just tell y'all one more thing. When I'm working, I book myself solid. Because if I have to be away from the kids... I want to be productive, like over the top, the whole time. Like I want to be making progress 
And so that's one reason I eat on the run. I don't take a lot of extra time. There, it's not a relax. It's a let's do everything we can, be on the phone constantly, whether I'm on the phone or actually seeing people. I try to book myself solid every minute. It's like back to back to back to back. So I know I'm in a drive right now. Once I get to my next location, we've just got bam, 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 all night. So I'm not gonna have time to eat later. So there you have it. <laughs> if you can see the magnitude of God's beauty. I had to pull over. I am driving home. I've been listening to music that just fires me up. And then I see the sunset. And you know, do you ever have those times in your life where you're like doing everything you know to do and sometimes you're not getting results? And then you just keep going. And you just keep saying, you know what? I've done this a million times. I'm gonna keep going, keep plugging. I've just had two wildly successful days of work and I just started driving home tonight after just an incredible day with my daughter and we were both working together and saw the sunset and I just felt God saying, I'm putting this beautiful sunset in the sky for you to see just to give you a little God wink and remind you that I'm in control always. Awesome day. Okay, y'all, I don't even know if you can see this sunset. It does not look the same in this video that it does in real life. But I had to pull over real quick after just wild success I've had these last few days, working, working, working. And I just wanted to share this gorgeous sunset. And I just feel like it's always God's reminder that He's in control. He's got it. Just keep going, keep believing, keep trusting. And I've had my music on that fires me up and just reminded of why we have breath in our lungs and that's just to honor the Lord. And oh my goodness, I had to show y'all this tonight. So glad to be home. Show me what you got. <laughs> 